must eat some love. It sparkles when I smell it. They really out here. Wow. Top chefing, bro. Pack your knives and go. Stop it. Wow. Let's ride. Stop it. Let's ride. We are doing a try not to eat top chef. Oh, oh no. no! I mean, of course, it's Top Chef. I feel like when you watch this show, like these are like really good chefs, yeah. like phenomenal. Chef, please pack your knife and go. I'm not happy with the fact that Ooh, I only have it's Kristen. The mushrooms. Mushrooms can get soggy, and so to prevent that, I throw them into a 450 oven after they're being washed. Oh, so yes, Kristen. that's my bitch right there. Right, right. as right. that. Make sure, sure. everything right. is perfect. Oh my god, I love Thank mushrooms. You. Thank, you Thank you so much. Oh, just. Simple mushrooms. Oh, it's just mushrooms. From Top Chef's new host, Kristen Kish. She's oh, I didn't. Host. What? She's I replacing Padma. I love that. What? We've got Kristen Kish's elimination winning dish of French mushrooms that simply blew the judges away. Let's sniff it up. Mm, they smell like shrooms. Oh, wait, these actually smell nice. I know. Smells good. Yeah, looks smells good. good. Looks amazing. I mean, she's a phenomenal chef. She's a winner. Oh, it smells so good. Oh my gosh. Uh, what are you gonna do? I don't know, man. I feel like I can skip this. I feel like I can skip it too. You were just talking about how much you love Kristen, though. I do. I mean, this is a limit. See, this is what Nicole does. She tempts me like this. Well, I mean, she she's, me. she's just bringing up a good point. You said Kristen Kish was your was your lady, and then you're you know scared to try her food. No, I not guess. scared. Yeah. Well, it seems like you're a little nervous. I love mushrooms. Girl, why aren't you eating this? I love mushrooms. Eat. Good so surprise. My mouth is watering. Who am I kidding? <gasps> Are you gonna eat in future rounds? Oh yeah. All right. Well, if, you, if you tell me this is good, I'll eat it. Ooh. Is it super shroomy? Oh my god! <laughs> describe it, describe it, describe it! Okay. They're not mushy mushrooms, they've got a slight crunch to them. There's definitely like a garlic, onion. I mean, we should try it. We should try it. Oh, you should try it. <laughs> so, I mean... How are you gonna let, how are you gonna let Kish down? How do they do this? <clears throat> when I cook my mushrooms, they don't taste like this. It's not bad by any measure of the word, mm -hmm. but I'm not a huge mushroom person, and this is, this is mushrooms. You know what, let's support our girl. <laughs> I'm eating, I don't care what punishment, I'm eating this all day, every day, every dish. Mm. It's actually seasoned really well. You, it kind of almost doesn't taste like mushrooms. It's gonna taste like meat almost, like the way it's seasoned. How much do you love mushrooms? Like how do you feel I, about mushrooms in your life? See, that's the thing. I can mm. do without mushrooms. Oh, but. Yeah. I think I can wait. I think I can wait. I'm strong. I like mushrooms. <laughs> then I'm glad I supported you in eating this. Because you. you're about to eat the whole plate. Mm -hmm. Yep. Thank yep. you. Absolutely. Oh, what a win. This I'm is gonna, messed up. I'm That's gonna, messed up. I'm going to discourage him from eating all the foods. Dude, where is my PPRI? It would really piss me off. That's fair. Why would you steal did it? Did you see that pee puree? I did not. The only person that has a pee puree on their dish is uh, Alex. It was not made the day before. It's really coincidental that Ed couldn't find his pee puree. I didn't even know he was making a pee puree. <laughs> Please, we have to turn this into a drinking game where every time they say pee puree, I yeah. <laughs> take a shot. I would be sloshed. Pee puree. Pee puree. Pee puree. Pee pee pee. Pee pee? Where's my pee pee puree? Oh my god, salmon. Oh my god, forbidden rice. Yeah, now this I'ma eat. You know, this I'ma eat. Oh my goodness. Wait, we don't have to wait for nothing. Where's my pee puree? From the pee gate of Top Chef season seven, we've got Alex Resnick's winning salmon dish featuring that infamous pee puree. Ooh, thank you. Oh, whoa. <laughs> yo, yo, check oh, out this bite. I'm gonna perfectly. Just, yo, a little bit of everything right here. Look at this. Oh my God, I yeah, can't I'm going not. in, I'm going in. I'm going oh, in. I'm going buckled. in as well. I'm going in too. It took salmon, why? I told you if there's a fish dish. Yeah. Get out of town. Mm. Ah, dude, look at that. Look at that middle. Like it's mm. perfect. It's cooked perfectly. Mm. I mean like it's like neon. Okay, creamy. Unexpectedly creamy, chunky. What's mm. happening, Jamie? Right. We got pea. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's pureed. Right. A little bit of salmon. Oh my god. I'm gonna look, look at, at it. it oh, man, that looks delicious. Mm. Pear. Is it pear? The pear on the salmon? Yes. Would not have thought to pair those two and love it. Pair those two. 
I see why this one. I as well. It's good. Delicious. Mm. Like, oh, no. <laughs> the pee pee is delicious. <laughs> I'd eat his pee pee all day. <laughs> it was a party in my mouth. Mmm! <laughs> uh, mm. Dude, it, actually, I really want to try it, but it's like, I, I want to win the prize and never win the prize. Uh, just for everyone, Alex Resnick did not steal Ed Cotton's pee puree. It was revealed. He made his own. They just edited it out of the show. And that's the magic of television. I was so sure. Mm -hmm. Ed's might have gotten misplaced in transport. Oh, <gasps> so he did it himself and he blamed him. <laughs> wow. Dude, you gotta eat all of it in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> I would steal that. That's good. I keep on second guessing myself. I know that I shouldn't. Don't second guess yourself. Just go. Being able to recognize that your dish is where it should be takes a lot of experience and it takes a lot of discipline. So I made a chilled uh, a sun soup. Dashi soup. Ooh. Served with some summer vegetables that have Ooh. carrots, summer squash, Long. and a little bit of sherbet. Ooh, sherbet. So sherbet. This whole table. Thanks, Paul. This is everything that I preached to Paul over the years is a balance of flavor and not over the Ooh. I'm smiling ear to ear. Ooh. Fancy. That is so fancy. Oh. That is a gorgeous color. It looks like, oh, it looks like Baja Blast. Cited as Judge Tom Clickio's best thing he's ever eaten on the show. Oh. No way. We've got a bowl of Chef Paul Key's chilled sun choked dashi soup. That sounds amazing, dude. When am I gonna have this, huh? Dude, I don't, I'm upset. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Can you smell it? You have to get really in there to smell it. Wow, there's a smokiness to this. Yes, absolutely. I'm just going with just this soup. Is it okay? Mm. Mm. <laughs> it's already good, bro. I'm just like creeping on you, dude. <laughs> I'm oh, like, how does man. it taste, Ben? <laughs> Is it warm? Do, do, do. Oh, no, it's, it's chilled. Just, like, you know, starts oh, it's off chilled. Like, on there, yeah. and it just moves around. Then oh, that's interesting. Beep, 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 beep. That's interesting. Beep, 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 beep. Oh. Mm. You didn't sell me. Didn't sell me. Good choice. Good choice. Okay, I'm getting crunchy. Okay. But I'm also getting like, is it like bourbon? Like oaky? I don't know how else to describe that. <laughs> Almost meaty somehow. But really fresh. But it's actually really good. What's in this? It's like, mmm. I'm so confused. What? I am a big fan of this. He's, you're really, you're really sad and scared right now that you're not gonna get to try this ever. Well, because what I'm thinking is like, what if I try it and I don't like it? Okay, you know what? Ooh. You know what? Ooh. Oh my gosh. That's really good. I, I don't, I've never tasted anything like this. Not anymore. How was it? Good, good. Delicious. Oh. This is amazing. I can, I'm just, I can do this all day. Chicken pot pie! Oh, yes. Oh. I was like, yes, I'm gonna make a chicken pot pie. <laughs> when was Jimmy noticed, Fallon like, on chicken, chicken pot pie? pie? We oh, we noticed. Oh my God, you, mm. you know that's gonna be delicious. I love pot pies. That's oh, what I'm yeah. saying. That is my thing. That I tell when I get She's a so pie, cute. He's so cute. Pie, I can't. Chicken pot pies are delicious. They are delicious. They're yeah. so good. Love put into this. Uh -huh. Oh, let's eat some love! Carla Hall couldn't contain her excitement for how much Jimmy Fallon loved her interesting take on a chicken pot pie, where the crust is on the top and the bottom. And after one bite, you'll also be just as in love. Ooh, it's so <laughs> fluffy! And the bottom of this is crispy as well. Yeah, show us, show us. I'm, I'm able to not do this. Oh, that's so cool. Oh my gosh. That's smart. Oh! Oh my god, that's so cool. That looks absolutely delicious. Are you kidding me? The crust. Yep. Oh my gosh. Have you felt the inside? Oh, that's good. Right. Oh, Jimmy Crickets. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? Are you kidding me right now? 
Do you guys just manhandle the pot pie? I know, Nicole's like, we did. you're gonna touch our pies so that now we can't eat them. I'm so sorry, Nicole. I'm so sorry that you can't eat this pie, uh, Nicole. Oh my gosh! You just ate it! <laughs> Carla, you really can't taste the love. Yeah, I know you didn't personally cook this. Chef Ash, you can really taste the love. I don't want pot pie! Mm. Uh -huh. mm, that's good. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh! I know I'm looking a mess right now, but... <laughs> no, you look like you're having a blast. It's like a sloppy Joe pot pie. You know what I mean? Good, good, good texture profile. Good, good, good sense of seasoning. And, um, good job. <laughs> Damn, wow. that smells good. Yo, it's, it's really good. Oh, mm, man. <laughs> Dude, mm. that smells delicious. Mm. Are you kidding me? Mm. I'm not a Popeye girl, but I can get behind this. Yeah? Mm. It's, it just feels like a home, like homey. Yeah, You know. comfort. Mm-hmm, 100% mm. comfort food. And after what I just did, I need that comfort. It's like my urge is to eat it, because every single time I, I just, I'm so used to dealing with the punishments, and like now I'm like so far in, but it's just like. You have one left after this. Bro, you're done, bro. Bro, 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 push this aside, man. I'm fun, so Jenna. happy right now. This is really good, though. This is so good. Out of all of the dishes in my menu, this oh. is the dish that I'm truly, oh, May. truly proud of. Let's see what I'm you got for us. The judges will love it. Now, the presentation is, is spot on. Wow. It's beautiful. That's a dessert. Oh, what is that? That's a dessert. Oh, I've ever seen oh, one. Oh, it's smoking. So oh. Oh. Sugary lime curd with curd. some toasted yogurt, a milk lime ice. with meat pollen and yogurt lime ice. Best dessert I've ever had on Top Chef. Oh. Dang. Dang. They really out here. Wow. Top Chefing, bro. Chef Malin's strawberry lime curd with toasted yogurt, milk crumble with bee pollen, and yogurt lime ice <clears throat> is often described as one of the best dishes to have ever eaten on the show. Mm. Did you smell it yet? No, but we've come this far without having any restraint. No! <laughs> Ooh! Ooh! I would love to know what this tastes like. Do you? Sure. I'd like to. I'd, dude, I'm like, a, I'd lick it. <laughs> I'd lick it if I could, man. There it is. <laughs> Get it! <laughs> what? Wow! 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 Flavors! Mm. It sparkles when I smell it. Does that make sense? <laughs> it doesn't have to make sense to anyone but you. Okay. This all looks absolutely amazing and I'm pissed that I chose not to eat because this looks so damn good. This is like the best tasting episode ever. You know this is gonna be so bad. This is gonna be so... This is so good. So you might as well enjoy this And the punishment can. is gonna be so bad? Oh, we can just... Let's live it up right now! Girl, it's not... Savor it. <laughs> I tried. Jamie, savor it. It was so good. I couldn't help myself. Try that with me with the pot pie. Hey, millions of people, this is for you. Here it is. Get it. Oh man. Mm. Oh, dude, that looks so good. Those those crumbles look absolutely amazing. I'm scared. Mm. This is one of the best desserts we've had on the show. Don't do that. No. Are you gonna lick the plate, Jamie? I'm really tempted, Jamie. <laughs> but I don't want to be gross. <laughs> so I won't. Are you serious, 50,000? <laughs> yes! I don't get double punishment for this. It still counts as one. I'm so happy right now. Dude, you just ate like a king. Or as they might say, you just ate like a top chef. <laughs> <laughs> I did. I feel like a top chef. I feel like I'm on top of the world, man. Huh? Well, that does it. Congratulations, Nick! Bro, uh, I don't know if I won. I don't know if I won. I don't know how you I, did it. I, I did, I, uh. Wow. You were able to avoid these top dishes, and for that, we've got a crafty prize. Um, I hope the prize is cool, because it, that was one of the most difficult things I've done in a long time. The cuisine here at Kraft is contemporary American. 
I call it contemporary American because the, the, the cooking itself is rather contemporary. Dad, why, why, did, why were there so many dishes? Of cooking and, and also we're in America. Oh, what's and that? The ingredients are American oh. ingredients. Is Nick getting all those dishes? For our winners, we have a lovely three-course meal from Tom Colicchio's very own restaurant, Kraft. First, we've got a very lovely foie gras on brioche, followed by some nice... Orchiette with or Italian sausage. Mm. And finally, a roasted quail in fresh blueberry sauce, and of course, a wonderful Pinot Noir that pairs perfectly. Oh, what to try first? Oh, I don't know. man. Um, that looks so um, good. Who, who, who are you? <laughs> <laughs> who is this? <laughs> what? what? Who is she? Why are you so small? What is this? Hello? Well, just, on. just so yeah, no, start, actually, I don't even want to look walk. anymore. No, look at it. I watched you eat, Benison. <laughs> I watched you eat all of those amazing you dishes. Did. I said you here. did. You did. I knew it. I okay, okay, yeah. Show it. me, show me. Hit that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Go. That's messed up. Let me smell the Pinot Noir. Oh, my gosh. And that is a good Pinot Noir. What are you doing? I think we should but just no, put this in no. our pants and walk What? Away. Wait, no, oh, no. wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. no. Oh, oh you gone. took them all away. Oh, oh <laughs> Unfortunately, Jamie, yeah, Izzy, yeah, Benison, yeah. Chance, and Martine, yeah. you were all tempted. And for that, Chef Ash has a uh, little present for you. So I did a little lemon meringue martini on the bottom of the okay, lemon. Okay, sounds yum so far. Like cherries hidden with a little oh, cookie. I'm wait, not that's so good. sure yeah, about that it I'm thinking it's Why are you not so sweet. sure about it? What? You made... Uh oh. Oh no. Today. I did. Oh, there's I did sugar. It was a little sweet. It was hard because No, it, it can't be that bad. I spit yours <gasps> into my napkin. Fabio's pasta. I like wow. the basil. I, I just don't get it sometimes when like it's fried on top and I don't get the paper. Put it there just in case you want to roll it up and smoke. <laughs> They're laughing at it. I hated the whole dish. I keep yeah. tasting it. I keep, to, to just to make sure that I that I actually hate it as much as I think I do. And I really, really, really hate it. Dang. We're getting two. It's, it's, two. It's, it's appalling. Do they combine no. them? No. They wouldn't com combine that a dessert and would they? We've mashed up two of the worst bites on Top Chef. The super sour lemon meringue martini with an appalling crab casareche, crawfish and crab stew. Enjoy. Okay, oh. so you decided as that was a personal challenge to do both. Of course. Okay. Why would I do anything else? It's fair enough. I should have expected better, different, man. Chef Ash always working magic out here. It's five bites and you gotta dig all the way down. With five you. bites? You, you ate everything, Venice, and you literally licked oh everything. Oh my god, I ate everything? <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh, yeah. <gasps> Smell that, bro. It's not so bad. I don't think it smells bad at all. Oh, it's like, <laughs> it's like sour, dude. It's like super sour. <laughs> oh, mm. oh, I hate all these flavors. I hate all of them. Oh, ow, ow, oh, ow. Oh, oh, it's so sour. Oh my God, it's like a warhead. Ah. The pasta is not bad. I think the stuff on top, whatever it is, gets better the more you eat it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> whoa. It's a, it's a kick in the pants every time. I hate this whole moment. I hate all of these flavors. Okay. Oh my gosh, you I did it. Get, get in there. Uh, oh, don't be shy. Uh, get in there. Oh. I got, I got numbers. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Wow. I gotta cry. Oh. <laughs> I gotta, woo. Well, that does it for today. Any final thoughts? Did you have fun? You know, pee puree. P puree. P puree. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers, bro. Oh! Thank you guys so much for watching this Try Not To Eat Top Chef episode. Let us know what you thought in the comments below, and be sure to like and subscribe and follow us on Instagram and TikTok. Nicole, pack your knives and go. Aww. Or you can eat the punishment with me. Cheers. Cheers. It does taste like beet, like sour. Whoa, it tastes like toe jams. Ew. Ew.